Hello and welcome to the Mountain View Instrumental Future Thunder Concert. We're glad that you're here with us today. Uh, we're sorry it can't be in person, but we're going to make it the next best thing. Okay. After all the stuff that's been going on this year, we just once again want to bring a little bit more music to your home. So hopefully everybody can enjoy it, even if they're far away. You know. And speaking of current events, you know about that ship that got stuck in the Suez Canal? The, what was it called? Uh, Evergreen, no, Ever Given. Ever Given. You know how we tell jokes all the time about Absolutely. on this on this show. Well, I, I wanted to tell a joke, but I figured that ship has sailed. I think we missed the boat. Yeah. All right. Okay. The kids asked that we never tell any more jokes ever again but on this. But the parents liked it. But so the parents like it. I think uh, we'll, we'll see where that goes. Yeah. Well, you might get one. You might not. Who knows? But anyway, on to what's really important. Some music. We're going to start with our jazz ensemble, and they are performing Freddy the Freeloader.
That was our jazz ensemble. As we transitioned into hybrid learning now, rehearsals look a little bit different than they did before when we were fully remote. Now we are able to have part of our students in class with us live, and we also have some participants that are there over Zoom, and we work together collaboratively to perform. We also have an A cohort and a B cohort, and so you heard the students that from both cohorts all together uh, who made that video. We work on music separately, but yet we perform together like you heard. Yeah. And so one of the things that we really missed out on this year is normally we have a Futures concert where we invite all the middle school students, band and orchestra, up to Mountain View and do a little rehearsal with them and then have a concert where they can kind of see what high school band or orchestra might be like. Well, instead of that, oh, we talked with our leadership guys and partnered with the middle schools and we ended up sending our leadership kids down to the middle school Zooms for the last four months. And what they did is they hung out with them on the Zoom, played with them, and actually started leading sectionals to be able to create that relationship which we so badly missed from being in person. Okay? And you're gonna see the fruition of that next. This uh, next tune is a collaboration between our middle schools and the Mountain View High School band. Okay? This is Escape Route. Thank you. being a part of band because it feels like a second family to me. Everybody cares so much about each other and cares so much about music. It's great. I like being in band because I get to play music with my friends and have my family watch me rock it on the tuba. Yeah. Band is meaningful to me because I get to express myself with more than just words. Hi, I'm Lydia and I like being in band because of the community. It makes me feel like I'm included and the people are very fun. I like band because of the sense of community that we create and how we work through everything together. The students 
stupidly funny moments with my section. I like being a part of band because it uh, allows for you to be a part of an amazing community with really great people. I love being in band because I get to create beautiful music and cultivate a community with some of the most amazing people I have ever met in my entire life. Say hi to the vlog. Hi. Hello. Hello. <laughs> Hello. One thing I like about band is making music with such a great group of people. My favorite part about the band program is the community and getting to travel. My favorite part about being in Mountain View's band is the bond we create through hard work and music, knowing everybody's part is important. The reason I like band so much is because the community around the band uh, at Mountain View is so incredible. Um, you feel so wanted and needed. It's, it's amazing. I like being in band because of the friends you make and how great it feels when a piece you've been working on for weeks finally comes together. Um, my favorite part about being in band probably has to be being able to make music with a really good community of people. I love band because of all the cool music that we get to play and all the cool people that we get to have come visit us and help us improve. I like band because I not only get to play fun music, but I get to do it with my friends. I like being in band because I get to have fun making awesome music and I get to be a part of an awesome community. I like being in band because it's a no judgment zone and I feel like I can be myself. I like band class because of the sense of community that you get within the program. Well, that was just great. We want to really thank our middle school friends for doing that this year. That's above and beyond. And that's the kind of stuff that makes memories. And while, like we talk about this year, it's not always the memories you thought you had made, we're going to still make good ones that are quality and worthwhile. So congratulations to you middle school guys. So glad that you were here. And thank you to the teachers who helped put that together. The last video that you saw was our band inspiration video. It was uh, our students talking about what they loved about being in music and performing music. And we just thought that instead of um, retreating within ourselves during the pandemic, that we really needed to get out and share with other people. And whether it be our music, and it could also be about what we're grateful for. And that's what those students were grateful for and what they like about the program. And what we are grateful for is the people who put those things together. And that's what we call our music cabal. Now, cabal is normally a bad term or something that's a little bit dark um, that you see on TV shows. But for us, it's a term of endearment. It's our top leadership guys of our band and orchestra. This year, it's four kids. And they have done a fabulous job at reaching out to figure out how we are going to engage our students. And this last video was one of those. They got videos from all the kids about what they loved, and then they put it together themselves. And it wasn't just this video this year. They have constantly figured out ways to virtually engage students, our kids, and others in other schools to come together and do something during the pandemic. And we are so thankful for them. If we could all give them a million dollars apiece, we would do it in a heartbeat. One of their projects that they came up with during this time was the idea that a lot of our middle school students wouldn't have the opportunity to sit down with their high school counterparts at a future Thunder concert and ask questions and make social connections and get information about what's high school like, what's music like in high school. And so they actually took it amongst, upon themselves to create a website 
and, and populate it with videos and resources for parents and students and families of current and future Mountain View students to answer those questions and to hopefully replace a little bit of those person-to-person uh, -person interactions that you would have been able to have during our Future Thunder concerts. We are going to put that website up on the bottom of the screen uh, during the next piece. So go ahead and check that out, everybody, and you can see the result of their hard work. I love orchestra because you get to connect with a whole bunch of people and create music you really love. Hello, I like orchestra because of the holiday music that we get to play at the end of the year. I like being in orchestra because I get to play music, which I love, with other people who also love it. I like being in orchestra because it's fun to play music. I love orchestra because it's the one period where I'm able to relax in and play my instrument as a stress reliever, but also because of the community that we've created at Mountain View. Hello, I enjoy connecting with my friends through orchestra and music. Being an orchestra because it helps me think outside the box. 
I like orchestra because it helps me meet new people and make more friends. I like orchestra because it's a great way to make music with others. Hi, I like being a part of orchestra because I feel like it has given me many opportunities to meet new people and make really great friends. Congratulations to our orchestra students that featured the Mountain View High School orchestra students as well as future Thunder orchestra members from Y East and Shehala. Congratulations to those students and also to their teachers for helping make that possible. Yeah. And so just like we have our cabal, which is our top leadership group, we have a larger uh, encompassing leadership group, which is about 30 to 40 students. And we just wanted to talk about them because um, they have been also integral in what we do here um, in reaching out and making connections with students in our own program and others. And they've been great at helping to plan virtual events, um, such like socials and hangs that we have over Zoom, as well as um, we've done these letter writing campaigns. And we all know that everything is electronic these days. And so they decided we're not just going to do something that could be thrown up on Snapchat or Facebook or whatever one other Twitter. Does anybody Twitter. use Facebook anymore? I don't know. Isn't Twitter? that for all my, people? My Twitter? Space? My, my Space is my the newest space. theme. Tom, my Tom's my friend on MySpace. Yeah. Hey, Tom's everybody's friend. Okay. So. Okay. But anyway, they went back and said, no, the best thing that you could do is spend the time to write a letter because if you take that time, it actually means something. And so these leadership students have taken time to write a letter to every middle school kid that may feed our programs as well as to connect with our current students to say this is what I remember about band or orchestra um, before the pandemic and what we can come back to and what are the things that we can currently keep going. So I just big props to them. They've also been people who've been going on to those middle school Zooms and just helping out wherever it's needed. And you want to talk about the resiliency of students well there you have it they can they can change on a dime to meet the needs of whatever needs to be done so props to you guys leadership people thank you so much and next you're going to hear from our jazz ensemble again playing doxy
percussion because of its strong focus on my skills and the sense of family that we build. One thing I like about percussion is the little family that we create with such great bonds. I enjoy jazz band because it exposes me to new genres of music that I don't normally listen to. I liked playing in jazz because you gotta play cool and unique music. I'm Lydia. I like being in jazz because uh, the teachers make it very fun and the music's really fun to play too. My favorite thing about jazz is the challenges it brings me to experiment with new things and learn with a different group. One thing I like about jazz band is just making a different kind of music that I usually don't hear. I love jazz band for the group energy that provides such a unique and exhilarating experience for not only myself, but for the band as a whole. My favorite part about being in Mountain View's jazz ensemble is being given so many opportunities to try new things in a safe space as a community. I like being in jazz because we get to play a different type of music from normal band that's very cool and very fun. I like being in jazz band because the music is fun and exciting and it gives you new opportunities to grow. I like jazz band because you get to play a different kind of music that you don't play in typical band class. With spring break almost upon us, it's time to look forward to the things that are remaining in this year that we are excited about. Right now, the Chamber Orchestra is involved in a creative composition project uh, where they're creating music, they're, they're writing lyrics, they're writing beats, they're doing all of this amazing work that's just been such a joy to work with them. We are looking forward to performing in some way, shape, or form at the graduation ceremonies at the end of this year. And we're even hoping uh, for the possibility of a run out concert outdoors. So weather dependent, you might hear from us and say, weather looks good then next week, we're gonna be playing. So be on the lookout for all of that and check in with your student and ask them what we're doing in class. It's, there's a ton of great music making happening and we're excited to share it with you in the days ahead. And as we look to the end of this year, um, we also want to look ahead to next year because plans are already being made. And it's going to look a lot more normal than this year did. Um, or we can tell you right now, and this is always a hit for kids, but we will be traveling with every school music group next year. Okay? Everyone, even if you're a freshman coming up, there's going to be travel for you. Another thing is, is um, the experience that we love so much is usually about all the extra things that we bring in, like guest clinicians or um, other workers or these after-school events where we get together in smaller groups to get to know each other and mingle within our band programs like solo ensemble and the lot, right? Those are all going to happen next year. So think much more about a normal year. And uh, honestly, we're always just trying to make it better and so I really think this next year will be the best year yet. We're going to try to make it that way. And now check out our next piece. This features our wind ensemble and our chamber orchestra in collaboration on a piece entitled Deus Ex Machina and there's some electronic music in here as well that was mixed in so it's just been a joy to put this together. Check it out.
Well, that was great. It is so much more challenging to perform in this virtual setting than it is to get together with a bunch of people on stage and perform like we normally do. So hats off to all the performers. Thank you so much for the work that you did to share with other people. And a special thank you to our Fine Arts Administrator, Corinne Ormson, as well as the Evergreen School Board and the Mountain View Administration for their continued support of Mountain View High School music. Yeah. We have to thank our, the MV Instrumental Booster Program. They constantly are doing all those little things that we never see and that you may never see, but that allow all of our program to run. And I would be remiss to say, if I don't make a public service announcement, that there are still volunteer opportunities that we need help with. So if you're willing to even spend a couple hours doing something or come to a game or some other um, function like that, please let our boosters know that you would be available. And just um, like our boosters, our parents make up those boosters and support the kids who made all these videos tonight. So parents, thank you for encouraging your student to take on a new challenge and to continue it during the pandemic. Hopefully it's paid off. And a thank you to Evergreen Video Services, Matt and Wade, for yes. recording tonight and for putting this together and collaborating with us to make all of this possible. We couldn't do it without you. Yeah. And the last people, and this is the most important, are you students. Um, it's not what we thought it would be, but we're going to make the best of it. And you just jumped on the ship and said, well, let's keep going. Um, so thank you for doing that. It's not something that you had to do, but it's a choice that you made. And it's the choices that we make in life that define us. And this was a positive one that you did. We're so thankful that you guys are in our program and that we get to work with you every day. So once again, our hats off to you. Thanks for coming out tonight, and we'll see you next time. Good night. Bye-bye.